Here we are today with three brick samples taken from the Nualtis facility in Montreal. We have three different bricks. Two of the bricks were done at uh, 4800 PSI pressure, hydraulic pressure and the third brick was done at the 3500 PSI as the um, uh, previous settings. Brick number one, two and three are all one liter tins full of oil based paint. All three bricks were washed after they came out of the machine, completely dirty and filled with paint. They were washed externally with a water-based pressure washer. Once the outside of the paint was removed, they were let to sit for an hour, and then as you see them now, were laid in the truck and took the ride back from Montreal to Toronto. When I picked up the, these bricks in Toronto, after one day of sitting, they were inside these plastic bags you can see here. And after 24 hours of sitting in the bags, you can see there's almost zero paint that was dripping out. Brick number one at 4800 PSI. I'm going to attempt to break one of the layers open. I've already started it just so that we can see how much oil based paint is actually trapped inside. So I'm going to take this and break open one of the sections. And as you can see inside that section, we have a thin layer of oil-based paint. All of these bricks were made without solvent flush internally and without solvent flush externally. To show you the level of paint that's inside, you can see it is a small film, but it's a very low content per brick. I'm going to attempt to get another layer apart. So we can see again we can see the very same thing there's an extremely low level of paint the red the dry residue there's nothing we can do about it that's what was in the bottom of the cans and the bricks are pretty solid as you can see from the surface the outside of it's nice and clean and I believe that this would be a very saleable product to the scrap dealers. I'm not going to attempt brick number two because it's too thin to break open. But brick number three, which was done at 3,500 PSI, you can see the laminations are a little bit looser. They should break apart a little bit easier. As you can see by that, this actually looks like there's even less film in it. I don't know why, because it's a, been made at a lower pressure, but there's really not that much. I've done three bricks with that same glove. I'm gonna rub it all over so you can see it's not a runny paint. And if I left it sitting, which I will, you'll see none of the paint is running off. It's just a thin film. The outside of the brick looks quite good. I'm going to go, that's all for now, folks.